hello good morning welcome to another isolation vlog uh i'm in a weird headspace today my camera hasn't opened is this even a surprise at this point um but yeah i'm in a weird headspace today and it's not necessarily a bad one it's just a weird one so what we're gonna do is firstly i've tidied my room and now i'm gonna tidy my office because it's very messy might go for a walk today i was supposed to be posting soul and fire orders today but i've realized it's bank holiday monday which means the post office is closed so i can post the things that are small enough to go in the post box but i don't think everything is so we'll see but i'm gonna pack some orders tidy my office i've started a new puzzle so we're gonna do that i need to water my plant um and it's just another homey day. I've got some laptop work to do. I'm not sure how productive this vlog will be because I'm honestly not in the most productive of moods. Um, but uh, hopefully you guys don't mind watching something that isn't super educational. Um, I'm trying not to beat myself up about that fact that not every vlog I do is gonna be like super creative design content because that is not 100% my life. So, right, let's sort this office out. Um, I actually have, I have a pile of stuff down here. These boxes have been here for months now um, and they're donation stuff so I can't even donate them now. So we're just going to have to leave them there um, along with these shoes. <laughs> I don't know why I ordered these shoes. I think I was being a bit extravagant but these are going in the donation pile as well. Um, so yeah, I have this pile of stuff. The lovely people at Gossy Box sent their limited edition Easter egg over um, and I opened it, took a photo and then I've left it on my floor for f a few days because I don't want no bugs in my house. So I left it so the bugs could die if there were any on, on there. But it had some really cool stuff in it. So thank you so much, Glossy Box. It's got like some face tan, which you guys know I should probably put on because I'm the palest person in existence. Um, I've got some First Aid Beauty Radiant Polish. I love First Aid Beauty. Glam Glow Insta Mud, which is really cool. I've heard so many good things about Glam Glow. I've got some Mascaria, Lashtopia, Bare Minerals Mascara, which is in this beautiful sleek packaging. An Illamasqua lipstick, which is actually in such a nice shade. It's so, so gorgeous. Like, that's right up my street. Uh, what else? I can't get the lid on. Um, there's this, a Carmen Tea Eye Gel Patch, amazing. There is Edible Lip Scrub, ooh, Edible, nice. Then there is this Scented Barry M Nail Polish, I love Barry M. Pretty much all of my regular nail polishes that aren't gels are Barry M. And then finally, this Ginger Root Moisturiser, Antioxidant to Help Calm Skin. I think my skin really needs that right now, not gonna lie. Oh my god it burns so i think i need to first find a home for all that stuff my drawers are getting a bit overfilled right now so we're gonna go through my drawers reorganize them put anything that can be don donated into that box and then i'm just gonna have to leave that box here for now until charity shops and stuff are open again i guess um and then i'm just gonna declutter my desk i've got the scales out ready to pack some orders um but first actually let's water my plant this little ivy thing i bought it from ikea and my parents didn't have much hope in me keeping it alive because i do kill every plant i own but so far it's doing good but it looks very dry and also i feel like ivy grows anywhere so i did pick an easy one so what i do such thrilling video for you guys so it has this bowl thing in it this probably has a name but i don't know what it would be called um and then in this we put water but it always gets mud stuck in it, so a <laughs> little bit of a hair grip. So it's got water in it now, and then I'm just gonna shove it back in there, and then it takes a drink when it needs it. I feel like it could do with a bit of a wash, not a wash, like a, a refresh. Let's just freshen it up. Okay, cool. That can stay there for a little bit. Okay, plant child number one is fed and watered. I tried to resurrect this, I don't know what this is. Is it? I don't know. It's succulent of some sort. However, like I literally went in the garden, I got some compost, um, I took that clipping out and I planted it again and it just got really dry and nothing's really happened. Like if I picked that up, it doesn't have any roots or anything. It's just kind of sat in the mud. So I don't know, maybe I should just leave that. Um, and I've got my cactus as well. 
and then I've got some little baby ones. The baby ones that everyone has from Ikea. I have these on my window too. So I'll just give them a little light watering. Right, plant babies are watered. Task number one. I also never know where to store this thing. It's so ugly. I should have got a cute one. All right, let's go to the drawers. So my drawers on the right hand side is generally crafty work stuff. And then on this side is beauty stuff. You can see me in the mirror, hi. <laughs> I'm using my chair as a tripod. This is the drawer of chaos currently. Um, I think all of these drawers are quite full at the minute. I mean, the makeup ones aren't. I don't really go in these very often. I tidied them recently-ish, so they're all right. Um, it's the lower ones. It's the ones that I go in more often. I've got like all my nail stuff organized pretty much. I bought myself some new gel nail colors. So I've got all them down here and then some other gels. And I actually showed you in another vlog, but I have all the nail colors here. Basically got a nail salon going on right now. And I've done my gel nails myself for ages, so isolation isn't something that made me do that. The nail drawer will do, that's fine. It's this, I sort of bulk bought my deodorant and then I've overfilled the drawer. Let's just give this a rejig. I've got like wax kits from my V roll-on. I don't really use that anymore because I use the IPL zappy laser thing. Do you know when you can like zap away your leg hairs? Me and my mum have been using that. Um, and it's been really good actually, so I don't really use the wax But also don't really want to throw it away, so I don't know Alongside that as well, I have so many body butters and body creams That come in like sets for Christmas, but again, I'm lazy I'm the most low maintenance girl, if you follow me on Twitter you'll have seen my tweet the other day because I am not struggling with any beauty regimes or not being able to go to a salon or anything like that because I don't actually do that much work to myself. <laughs> I'm so lazy, it's unbelievable. I love the sunshine, but it does ruin the vlog setup. I'm gonna leave the scales there because I kind of need to post some stuff. I can't remember if I mentioned in the vlog, but I was going to post orders today, but it's bank holiday Monday, which means I can't post orders today. Um, but if they weigh less than 100 grams, I can. I just need to put them in the post box and they won't get picked up till tomorrow. Um, which means I can go for a walk as well. So, um, I'm going to leave the scales there, basically. <laughs> was the conclusion of me telling you all that for no reason. the orders and as I was ordering as I was ordering as I was packing um one of my pals one of my old internet pals has ordered one. Oh my god thank you so much honestly you've just made my day seeing familiar names in my orders never gets old it's so cute when my like real life pals support you know let's just put a really big smile on my face so here's your order girl um yeah I've done I've got one more that I do need to do but um, I just need some information she forgot to add the information I needed so I've emailed her um, so hopefully I'll be able to post that out with everything tomorrow but yeah I'll tidy up now um, oh that's probably put a smile on my face I hope I hope everyone likes it what they get um, and I promise there'll be more products coming soon I'm slowly getting my mojo back I think I just needed need some time to process as I'm sure you understand <laughs> 
all but one of the parcels is under 100 grams which means I can go to the post box later um, I'm not going to rush because obviously it's not going to get picked up today um, in fact should I do it tomorrow don't know how I feel about my products being out in the cold overnight in a post box probably should go tomorrow um, but yeah I'm glad I've got that done feels good everything's stacked up ready to go um, I can smell a dinner cooking We're having Sunday dinner on Monday which is going to be great um, but in the meantime, I'm going to quickly do some emails. Oh, and I can tick off um, packing orders on my to-do list. I've decided to really simplify my to-do list. And by that, I mean I'm writing on it things like get ready, get dressed, put makeup on. Because we all need to celebrate the little victories right now. Because even if that's all you can manage, you did it. And even if you're spending all day in bed watching Netflix, oh well, <laughs> when else are you going to have a time like this to do something like that? Um, for example, yesterday I spent the entire day doing a puzzle, which I am going to continue doing later on today because I was very much enjoying it and it's the one thing that's been taking my mind off everything. So, yeah, I hope you're all doing good. Right, I'm going to do some emails. <laughs> dinner has been inhaled my hair is doing whatever it wants what is this i don't know um but i'm gonna go downstairs because as we were watching dinner annie came on you know the original annie film and i freaking love that film so much fun fact but i actually i'm just trying to find my slippers i actually played miss hannigan in a play thing once and it was so cringe and I was so bad but at the time I thought I was so good um so it's given me all the feels so we've paused it because it was on like gold tv or something like a random rogue channel um and we're actually going to watch it so I'm going to go downstairs put my slippers on because it's gone really cold um and I'm gonna start on another colouring page I think so I'll um insert a little time lapse hopefully of a colouring page in process maybe I'll get it done we'll see I've been putting it off I've been doing that thing where I like I've been drawing it in my head okay I do this a lot does anyone else creative people you probably know I come up with an idea in my head and then I get scared to put it down on paper in case I don't like it and then I get annoyed so I just don't put it on paper I avoid the whole thing completely um and i've been doing that with a lot of stuff recently so i've decided i need to stop and i recognize it every time and i do it still i think it's just how i've always been um but i'm like avoiding getting started with something just in case i don't like it um which is not the right attitude because i could just try again so i think i'm going to do a sea theme so like a submarine a fish some seaweed bubbles stuff like that um, like coral and then we'll see sort of what that looks like I might have to go on Pinterest as always to get some ideas but that's what we're going to do so I'll insert a time lapse and hopefully I'll get it done because I've been meaning to do this for two weeks and I actually really do enjoy drawing them so yeah I just need to stop putting so much pressure on myself progress has been made with the colouring page. As of me filming this clip I've only done like the first outlines but I'm probably going to insert the whole thing so I'm determined to get finished tonight and if I don't insert the whole thing you'll know that I didn't do it so yeah but I've just had a message from my kickboxing instructor um, asking where I've been for the virtual classes for the past week <laughs> because I've not been. The first two weeks we did every single one um, Monday, Wednesday, Friday and then I skipped a few when I had my little meltdown and I've not been back on it since. So I've missed, I think, actually I've only missed three lessons, so it's not been too bad. But I've just got that message and I, he was like, are you coming? And I can't, I don't, I don't have a reason not to go. So we're going to do it. I've just told my dad. Um, so I'm going to put my gym stuff on. I've unfastened my trousers. I've just been for a wee and I didn't fasten them back up. But we're all friends here, aren't we? I'm going to put on some of my new Fabletics stuff. Honestly, I if I'm not in normal clothes, I'm in my Fabletics gym stuff. It's 
such nice quality and they very kindly gifted it to me like a few maybe two months ago a month ago now and i'm obsessed i can't wait to get some more i keep browsing their website and then resisting the urge and closing the tab but i've got a lot of things saved um so yeah i'm gonna put on some leggings I think I'm gonna put these ones on. These are the, the power hold ones, the ones that everyone talks about. Um, and they're really soft and comfortable, but hold everything in at the same time. So I'm gonna put these on. And I also really like this bra because it zips up at the front, which means I don't have to try and awkwardly fasten it and get it over my head. I'm gonna change from my semi put together outfit into gym gear. Let's go. Ta-da! Okay, we're dressed, I'm in, comfy, ready to go. Okay, we did it, we're back. I'm so tired. I ate half a banana before we did it and I regretted it instantly. <sighs> but yeah, I'm glad I did that. Um, I think I'm gonna finish the colouring page but you guys will have already seen the finished thing before the gym clips. Um, so I think I'm gonna end the vlog here to be honest. I'm gonna have a chill night. I'm deciding whether to go in the bath or just have a quick shower and then chill watching Disney in my room or something. Who else has got the Disney Plus subscription? I used to have Disney Life, which is basically the same thing, um, and I cancelled it a couple of years ago. I bought it as, like, uni research, because my dissertation was on Disney. So yeah, I'm very happy to have Disney Plus in my life again. I don't really know why I cancelled it in the first place, but yeah, I feel like that's why I'm going to spend my evening. So I hope you're all having a good day. I hope you've enjoyed the little vlog, and I'll see you soon for another one. Good night. <laughs>